This is now day um, 17 in government quarantine. Um, we were tested on the 14th day to see if we had COVID-19, a directive that was brought in the day before, like the directive that was brought in for institutional quarantine. Whilst we were in the air traveling over here, we were not reckless in our plans to come out here. We observed what, what the travel advice was. There wasn't any travel advice in, pl in place for Uganda at the time. There were no confirmed cases of COVID-19. As it currently stands, there are 44 cases of COVID-19 in Uganda, zero deaths. All cases are imported. So as it stands, we've been in government quarantine. Everybody in this quarantine is currently exhibiting no symptoms of, co exhibiting no symptoms of COVID-19. The tests were taken on the 14th day. We are still being held here. We have no health certificates. We are still being charged, more importantly, for every night we spend here. And they're not issuing the health certificates. They're not issuing the test results. And it's not fair. Um, and it's not right that we should be treated like this. So I'm currently staging a peaceful protest in the lobby of the hotel, where I will sit here observing the, um, the, the social isolation where we're keeping a distance of six feet from everybody else. But I am now urging everybody else that's here with me in this quarantine to join me in this protest because this is not fair. You can't treat people like this. We have been more than willing to cooperate. We did everything that was asked of us and the goalposts continually move and change and you cannot treat people like that so i will be making a stand i will remain here i will not be taking any food any water until this is resolved